I have a full body dumbbell workout plan for you today. You will need, here they are, uh, some light dumbbells for shoulders, arms, and then at least one heavier dumbbell for legs, back, and biceps. All right, we're gonna jump right into the warm up. Feet nice and wide, shoulders down the back, open up, just as huggers. Soften up the stars. I forgot to mention, you will also probably you need a mat or a towel or something to weight into the floor. But that's back love. your back or your knees. That's just All right, let's windmill. Left you arm, right shoe. Right back, switch it. Soften those knees. Stretch right back up tall. Nice and long I spine to twist. And then rotate one more a little slow. All right, so soft knees. Pick it up a little faster. Okay, if you're watching this video, if you work out with the word, let me know how the audio feels on your end. It might be music or a good mix. Alright, hold this wide, lunge to the right, bring it down, up, side lunge, push to the outer edge of your foot. Alright, swish it, lunge to the left, outer hip, wake up those legs. We are going to do side lunges in our workout today. All right, one hand per thigh, single, just drop, drop. The walls are closing Set the hips back, and it seems limber it up, nothing makes it add a little reach for the floor, you should try windmill, to windmill, that's just how rotate it is. behind. When it comes to love, Three. comes to love. All right, center up, heel toe, heel toe. You know, We're gonna swim it backwards. Big swim, big swim, swim, swim. Abs in tight. Sometimes it can be beautiful. Little backstroke. That's just love. Four. Four tight. Four. Three. Here we go. Twist right, left. Twist. Twist. Tuck this mic cord in my tank top. We'll see how it works. It is super windy today, so sorry if you can hear that over the microphone. And roll in. Reach overhead. And tap the toe. Take it wide with the feet. Stretch out that waist. Beautiful. About four more. Okay, with some body weight squats, you narrow your stance, here we go, squat down, and up, hips go back, these are tracking, same direction as the middle of the foot, lower those hips, okay, so our first track, we're doing a heavy dumbbell goblet squat, I'll show you guys here, now, I don't have a super heavy, and I know that if you're working at home, you might not have super heavy, so F15, Goblet grip, palm to face, thumb to your chest. We're gonna start with a sumo. So heels are in, they're gonna drop down four, then we'll pivot to the right and lunge to the right four. We're only gonna do the right side for this song. Here we go, slide your back, down and up. Yeah, slide. Okay, I'm gonna start counting right here. Here we go, four, three, two, four, three, two. Shine your inner thighs. Last two like that. Back down the wall. So you're not pitching forward. Go ahead, pick up your left heel. Turn to the right. Lunge it. Straight down. But really, actually, it's a split squat. Four, three, two. Four, three, two. Chest is lifted. The weight's right over the hips. Beautiful. Pivot back to me. Let's go two. Two. One more. All right. You know what to do. Turn to the right. Left heel up. Four, three, two, one more. To me. All right, one and one. Squat. Pick up that heel. Split squat. Do it again. Center. Heels in. Toes out. Pick it up. Pivot. Good. Okay, let's add a little pulse to the bottom right here. Three, two. And pick it up. Pivot. Three, two. I'm under tension. You got one more. Now we're gonna stay on this side. Front arm takes the weight. Pick your back leg up. Bring it in a little bit. We're hinging. And then stay right back up. Chest is lifted. Collarbones wide. Weight in the right heel. Hinge it. Good. One more. Long spine. Single leg deadlift. All right. Rack it up with the shoulder. Push press. It's a split stand push press. 
push to the sky. Use your legs. Get that weight up. Kind of a power move. Let's combine those two. All right, lower down, slow, slow. Push up. Okay, so we got some combo moves here. Rock to the shoulder, push press for four. Four, three, two, one more. Smooth it out, lower down, hinge it for four, three, two. One more, one more. Hinge. All right, push press to the shoulder. Four times. You get it? All right, single leg that lab. Woohoo, hinge. I'm starting to feel it. One more, stay square. Shoulder rack, four pushes. Use that breath. Last time, hinge and lift. You make it a nice long move, dramatic. Rack it up, push, press. Four, three, two. <laughs> Back to me, goblet grip. Good. And lift, heart to the sky. Slide down that wall. Nice and slow. Get your thighs to me. Press up one more. All right, pick up that heel. Lunge is slow. Four, three, two. Four, three, two. Burn it up. Now, if you wanted to, you could always hold two weights. It just made that second combo a little trickier with two. Center plie. So I purposely had you holding one, so that way we could combine this whole flow with the push press and the single leg deadlift and have it asymmetrically loaded. Let's find the V. Here we go. Four, three, two. Four, three, two. I turn my music down a little bit so I can't really hear it very well. All right, start counting. Here we go. Down and up. Okay, so <laughs> you like start counting. Well, we already did a few. We need bonus ones, okay? Last one. Now you're gonna pick up your right heel, split lunge, split squat, other side. Press back up. Four, three, two. So I found two songs with a very, very similar BPM and very close to the same length. All right, back to me. Two, here we go. Four, three, two. Drive the heels. Get lower, now pivot. Turn to your left, load that left heel. Good, your back knee can kiss the floor if you wanted to. All right, center to me, one and one. Four, three, two, push up, pivot, and split, squat, there we go. To me, down, and up, turn it. You know we gotta add the three pulses. Here we go, pulse bottom. Three, two, press it up, pivot. With that left eye. Three, two, are you ready? <laughs> Here we go. We're getting ready for that single leg deadlift. Step it in a little bit. Front arm holds the weight, hinge it. Back up. Chest wide. Other arm is out for balance. That foot's a kickstand. Most of the weight is on your front leg. Soften the knee. Hinge. All right, push press. Rack it to the shoulder. Use the legs and push. Legs and arms. Power there. So I'll turn to the front just so you can see what I'm doing here. You got it? Let's combine those two. Here we go. Bring it down. Hinge. Two. Pull up. One more. Put it in your glute, your hamstring. Now rack it. Push, press four. It's a split stance. Use the legs. One more. Here we go. Hinge it. Hips go back. It doesn't have to be that low. Chest is open, rack it, push, press, push. You getting sweaty? <laughs> Here we go, hinge. Back up, one more. Load up this glute here, rack to the shoulder, push to the sky, four times. One more. All right, goblet squat, here we go. Down and lift, now turn it, turn it. Down and lift. You know this move. And lift. Pick up the heel. Lower. Let's go two and two. Right back up. One more. Down. 
Now pivot, pick up the heel. You got two split squats. Try to make 90 degrees from that front knee. Center, plie. Use the breath, okay? It should feel kind of like you're pushing your heels away from each other. One more set, here it is. Split squat, one more. All right, let's swing it out here. Down and up. Just give me a couple more here, don't let go. Hold on tight. One more. All right, take it in the right hand. Okay, Our right hand holds the weight. Left leg's gonna step forward. Hand to the thigh for support. Low rows here, chest lifting. Really heavy in this front heel. All right, now push into this foot, come up. Side bend. We did in the first, first part of our workout. We're gonna do two moves, put them together. Left leg to me, step forward. Lunge and row. Yup, yup. Lose the back. Row to the rib or the hip. All right, step into this leg, push away. Here we go, side bend. Slow. Good. Bring it to the waist and the back. One more. Left leg to me. Get low in that lunge. Here we go. Row it. Chest up. Keep it on your elbow. On the tail. Get lower in that lunge. Extra credit. Four. Last two. If you're ready to push in that left heel, come on up. Side bend. Squeeze. Yeah. Side bend. Strong waist. Strong core is going to help support your spinal column. Squeeze. One more. All right, step to me. Here we go. Step forward. Lunge and row. Right to the hip, the rib. We have the option. Get on that elbow. Get a little lower. Last two. One more. Push away. Here we go. Here, but don't lock those knees. Soft knees. Get ready, left leg to me. Get low in that lunge. Step to me. Row. Release. There's definitely some downsides. <laughs> Alright, push. Stand up. Here we go. Side bend. Lift. So I get off the beam on this workout. That could be why. It could also just be me. Something could be wrong with me. One more. Step to me, left leg. Here we go. Low row. Heavy in this front leg. Squeeze it up. Use your breath. Two. One. Push away. Here we go. Side bend. Oh, and you're done. Nice job. Switch hands. Same move. Other leg, other arm. You're gonna step your right leg to me in that low lunge. A nice row to the rib. Raise this back down. Here we go on the B. Up and down. Up and down. Now the back heel is lifted. My hips are square. Chest up. Now push into this leg, come back in. We're gonna side bend the other way. Stretch and squeeze. Do little standing abs. Now you can use your heavier weight for this. I bet you can. Try it. You might surprise yourself. Work in that waist. One more. Get ready, right leg steps to me. Low lunge. Here we go. Row it up. Up to the ribs. Maybe even back to the hip. Working your posture muscles. Thumb is forward. Piggy back for these ones. Last one. Step it in. Here we go. lower challenge yourself now work your muscle fibers in this leg which I know we already worked but if you want more add it 
One more. All right, push away, stand up, feet nice and wide. Side bend, squeeze back up. So the goal here is to get everything to work total body as best as we can in 30 minutes. Where you like to be, step forward. Row. So that probably leads to some combo moves. You can always break these apart and do them on their own. Last two. And one. Step it in nice and wide. Side bend. Set it up. Your hips are stable. Elbow nice and wide. Right fingertips just behind the ear for the base of the skull. A little stretch. A little squeeze. Step forward. Let's row. These songs. Song four, song five. A little shorter. So I only put in one top of it. One more. Push it to the foot, stand up, feet wide, side bend. Here we go, stretch it out. Squeeze together, rib to hip. You can put this other hand wherever you want it, wherever you need it. Sometimes I even like just feeling the muscle groups that I'm working, palpating them. It's your quadratus lumborum. Step to me, right leg, lunge, row. Hey, hey. Well, let's do a couple more. And done. Woo. Stand on up, grab your light weights. So I have eights today. Uh, Now. We're gonna start with a lateral raise. Feet about shoulder distance. I don't knees, tailbone under. We're going to go to the side. Raise this back down. Knuckles up. Here we go. Three, two, one. Control. The lighter weights for longer levers. Hip breaks around right where your shoulder is. Here we go. Up fast. Freeze. Fast. Hold it. Hold it. Up halfway down, and then all the way up. Get it? Up, halfway. Like a pulse, but worse. Halfway. Soften those knees. Keep it out of your neck, baby. Right arm, left arm, single. Alternate the sides here. Top of the shoulder. Medial deltoid. Ribs are hugging together. Belly to spine. Last two. All right, thumbs forward, let's front raise forward. And down with control. Four, three, two. There we go, Bring the anterior to the front of your shoulder. Okay, same combo. Up fast, hit the brakes, here we go. Fast with the brakes. Leg. 
twice. Hips all the way back. Okay, you know the tempo. We'll reverse it, okay? Down slow. Here we go. Slow. Slow, and then you push fast to the top. Three, two. Push both legs to the top. Slow. Slow. Okay, you know, we did it with the arms. Down. Halfway up. All the way down. All the way up. Down. Halfway. There it is. Yeah. Send them back. Keep the chest up. All right. We're going to stay down and hold it. Three counts. Here we go. Hold. Oh, good. Hit the brakes. Hold. This is your last standing song. Promise. We go to the mat next. One more. Stay down on this one. Right heel up. Let's tap to the side. Stay low. Side, now tap to the back. Stay low. Find your balance. One side, one back. Two more. Don't come up, don't come up. One more. You ready? Plant your right foot, left foot. Tap it out, side and back. Don't come up. Side. Am I coming up? <laughs> don't cheat yourself, Tara. One more. Side. <laughs> Press those weights overhead. Here we go. Press. And lower. Thumbs to the back. Stagger your stance. Brace the core. Nice neutral grip. Overhead presses. All right, up fast. Down slow. Three, two, one. Slow. Slow. Yeah. Fast. Slow. You know the next one, right? Fast. Okay, up, halfway down, all the way up, all the way down. Now, I have a staggered stance because it feels better in my back. You can always have a parallel stance, but watch out for overarching. One right, one left. Here we go, singles. Right, left, all the way up. No lock in the elbow, but let's go full range of motion. It's your lighter weights. Hopefully, if you have heavier weights, Modify. Go slower. <laughs> Woo, rack them. Let's squat. Slow. Good. Now too fast. Down and up. Do it again. Slow, slow. Four, three, two, one. Too fast. Woo, singles. Just bust them out to the end of the song here. Now, if you're like, I'm already dead, Tara, <laughs> just the anyway, will work. Bust out these squats. Find back up though. Woo. And done. Put your weight somewhere close to where your head will be. Lightweight. We are gonna head down to the mat. Feet at the back edge of the mat. Slide down your thighs. Bend your knees. Walk your hands forward. One hand at a time. Land. Top of your plank. Tell one under. You can always go to your knees, and you can always fist up. Customize and modify. This workout is yours. Own it. We're gonna pike the hips up. Belly button in. Here we go. Down dog. Exhale. Lift. And then roll it forward. Land and flip. Pike it up. Roll through. Quick weight. Lift. Roll. One more. Pike it up. Mountain climbers, right and left, march them in. in. Now, if you need to, you can customize this. You can take the top and just tap back. Or if you want to go up level, you can run this. Four, three, two. All right, down for those forearms. Lower forearms, hold it. We're in this plank. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Everything's a straight line. Crown of the head to the feet or the knees. Whatever version you're doing. Well, okay, whatever, whatever you are, be a good one. Okay, we're gonna pike the hips up. Here we go, hips up, lift it up, then roll forward, land in plank. Pike it up, forward, land in plank. Really push those elbows, forearms, into the mat. Zip your core, one more. Pike it up. We're gonna hold the plank. Just tap right, left. So, so, little side taps. Think like a jack. Option, you could be on your knees. Go a little slower. Or if you want to spice it up, you could jump these a little faster. Four, three, two, rest. Roll the wrist, belly to the floor. 
squat. Let's go. Find your way on down. Superman's up next. So move your weights if you need to. Arms overhead. Legs out long. She laces down. You're gonna lift up all four limbs. Release them down. Here we go. Slow. Belly button in. Lower. Think about pushing your pelvis down. But suction your belly up. Protect your back by squeezing up instead of pushing down with the mid section. One more like that. All right. Just the arms, reach them up, and then pull down like a lat pull. Overhead, lower down. Lift, squeeze, pull it in. Think like you're doing a pull up. Chin slightly tucked, so we're not craning too much of the neck. Once you know what we're doing, look back down. Question of can you? It's will you <laughs> get those back muscles fired? Here's your last one. Nice and good. Lift, squeeze, and rest. Slide those hands underneath your shoulders. Pick yourself up. All fours. Child's pose. A quick stretch here before we head into our last song. You're gonna grab two light weights and swing yourself so that you are facing upright. So go ahead and put the weights in your hands first. Roll yourself down with control. Belly button in. Weights overhead. Chest fly. You're going to open. And close. And then bend your elbows. Skull crusher. Yeah. Got it. So elbow soft. Open. And close. Now skull crusher. On the outside of the ears. Control the weight. If the weight feels like too much, you don't have control over it. You're going to put them down. You're going to get a lighter set or do body weight. I don't want you dropping the dumbbell in your face. Let's add, if you're ready, knees over the hips, shins to the tabletop, out, and in, squeeze. So this is going to challenge your lower core muscles, transverse abdominis, keeping that spinal column pushing you loose to the floor. Let's add, legs out, you got it, kick them out, pull in, same thing for the tricep, kick them out. Here it is. You can go ahead and put those feet back down. Underneath the knees, you're going to bridge the hips and lower with control. So we're going to just get the legs here first before we add any arms. So just squeeze your waist together so that you're pushing palm to palm, feet to the mat. We're going to add a little lat reach. Lift up, squeeze. Now lower the hips, stay here. Arms go overhead. Hold the center, yeah. Push into the bridge. Release back down. Arms overhead, lap pull. Now we combine them. Reach. <laughs> and bridge. Arms overhead, butt down. Bridge. The answer could be no. You say no, Tara. I'm going to keep those two separated. Honor your body. The bridge and the lats can be done separately. We still get a lot of bang. down by your sides, hug your knees to your chest. Congratulations, you did it. Rock side, side. Maybe shake your head no. Nod your head yes. If you don't have a ponytail on like me. <laughs> Keep one knee, send the other leg out. Let's circle the ankle of the shin that you're holding. Deep breath in. Send the leg to the sky, hands to the hamstring. Let's stretch out the back of this leg here. Congratulations. Nice 30 minute workout. Let's switch it. Other side. Knee to chest, other leg long. Roll the ankle of the leg that you're holding. Pull your lungs up. Let's take a hamstring stretch. Hands to the back of your leg as you send your foot to the sky. Straightening your knee, but never all the way. 
beautiful. Release that. Put both feet down underneath your knees like you're about to do another hip bridge, but don't worry, we're not. Extend one leg, flex the foot, cross it over your thigh. You can push open, or you can reach through and hug for a figure four outer hip stretch. Try to relax your head, relax your hips. So if the music was a better balance for you guys, then that's what I want because it's about the video, not about like my experience building it. So let me know. <laughs> Although this is my workout today, so I cheated that. Switch the other side because as a fitness instructor, you're never supposed to um, make the class you work out. <laughs> Choose, you can either hug through or push your thigh open, not the knee joint. It was busy today, it was a really busy day. So I'm gonna have to just count it. It's already getting kind of late here as I film this in summer. And I know that you can see that there's still daylight out the window, but like it's getting close to bedtime. So this cool down feels great. Release that foot, uncross the ankles, drop the knees one direction. We'll push ourselves up here, turn and face the mat. Let's do some quick cat cows for that spine. Knees under hips, palms under shoulders, round. Chin to chest, squeeze the belly up. Reverse, soften the belly down, lift the heart, lift the tail. One more. Lift, excellent. Step your back leg forward. Let's take a quick little kneeling hip flexor stretch. Maybe even reach both arms up. Excellent, slow release. Frame your foot, switch sides. Step your front leg forward, lift on up as you press that hip towards the floor. Maybe reach those arms up. I hope that this workout left you feeling better than you did before when you push play. Release those hands, step your foot back, tuck those toes under, and as you do, pick up the knees, walk your feet to your hands. Let's roll it up. Thank you guys so much for working out with me today. I appreciate you.